You're watching Africa Mogo. My name is Amatricia. Shoma released his 10 a.m. album where he's released a couple of songs from the album, which he featured other colleague um, artists on those songs. Some of this song really trended a lot and fans seem to have jumped to the song. So Strongman has taken to Twitter to give us, you know, there's a possibility that he may be releasing a new song titled Big Boy. So he's released this um, short video of him actually dancing. You can see that there's a video shoot ongoing. So Ty Tomzi will be telling us more about this Big Boy song, which will be released soon, hopefully. Now, what what is going on with Strongman? Okay, um, we strong man. When we say strong man, so oh yeah, they are um, obefa tax. Mm -hmm. Then he brings them on Twitter and stuff like that. And then mm -hmm. here, when you follow him, you could see that he has dropped some videos just like you said. Yes. But he has muted whatever mm -hmm. he's doing, mm -hmm. and then you could see he's going around doing some one two stuff like that. So it made us suspect that man, this could be a, what, a song because initially it's be dropping him out with the bossu and then with the pilulu and other stuff mm -hmm. like that. He did the same movement. So we are feeling that this is a new song is about to drop. What do you think this song will be about? Um, big boy, big boy, big boy. It's going to be a commercial song because he said from the initial that this album will be mostly commercial. So maybe it might even be a collaboration because some time ago he said among all the 10 songs it's going to be collaborations for, I mean, 10 artists. Mm -hmm. So it will be not acquire another song with another artist. But for now, only him doing the things. We don't know who is going to bring on so you should be expecting a feature yeah okay now let's focus on the 10 a.m album okay. um he's released bossu with medical walai with dope nation mm -hmm. and pilolo with kelvin boy can you tell us how these three songs have been doing so far okay so um you know we all know strong man to be doing these hardcore raps and stuff yes. like that and then this time around we decided to go i mean commercial just like the way south korea ever switch here mm -hmm. so yes it's good he took that step and then he has been releasing or dropping some songs, which is what you just mentioned right now. Mm -hmm. Bosu did very well. Um, P. Lulu with Kelvin Boy also did very well. And then also Walai, which is the recent one, is also doing well. So if you look at the numbers, Bosu had 439 key, okay. Walai had 85 key, and then P. Lulu had 505 key, which is very good for him. Because um, when he was with Success, I think the song with Akwabwa gave him a million views, mm -hmm. something like that. And now he's on his own. This is his own personal channel, and he's getting these numbers, which is like half a million views, which is cool for him for now. Yes, so he's he's doing great. Okay. So some people have argued that his beef with medical had paved the way. It had helped him in his career to help even push all the songs uh, forward. Do you think so? Uh, in some way, I would say yes, because before mm -hmm. this beef, when you check Strongman's uh, following on YouTube, he was around. 20 something, okay. 20 something key. Mm -hmm. And then after the beef, he jumped straight to 60 something to 70, which was good for him. Mm -hmm. So that beef will actually it helped him. It helped him a lot. Yeah. Yeah. So I saw a tweet of Sean Man, and he was actually saying that his fan base has really grown. Mm -hmm. And it's, he seems to be the talk of town. Yes. Like one artist that people are talking about. Do you think, what do you think he did best, and what do you think he should continue doing to keep this um, fame he's getting right now? I think it's all about the commercial things mm -hmm. he's doing right now. Okay. After the beef and then he has jumped to do the commercial things. The hardcore rap is there. A woman not there, not their okay. frap. And yes, a very hardcore sound. You, you, you still be suffering. Look at T Flo. T Flo is doing great with the rap and everything. He's standing for the culture, for the hip hop thing. But still, he ain't showing who the numbers we are. Mm -hmm. But Stroma has switched a bit to what? The commercial, commercial side. Having Kelvin Boy bringing him on. Having Walai, these people are yeah. also this kind of people. And yes, the songs are going. So now, Charlie, Charlie, Rita, we are also paying numbers for crap plus the money. Can't. I can't be saying the hardcore rap, yeah, the mm -hmm. hardcore rap, and then you'll be suffering with the numbers and stuff like that. He switched to commercial, he's making numbers, and then to, uh, this one, Strongman is also switching and he's making numbers. M uh, Manifest is sticking to hip hop, the numbers is low. Tiflo is also sticking and the numbers is what? Low. low. So, where you want, maybe I'll be an alpha. Okay. So you've heard it from the man Teddy Tomsey. Now, Shoma was actually featured on Eno Baroni's song and his verse, Ghanaians are saying he nailed it. So I enjoyed it as well. Now, thanks for watching Africa Mogo. Do like the video, subscribe to the channel and leave your comments. It is very important. Leave your comments. Thanks for watching. Once again, my name is Amatricia and I did the discussion with Teddy Tomsey.